That was so fun. <laughs> oh, welcome back to the channel, guys. Happy Monday. Hope you guys are all kicking ass out there. Today, we're going to be talking about getting out of our comfort zone. Let's get into it. All right, everybody. So throughout my season, as an instructor, as a coach, as a guide, whatever we're calling me, I'm out here riding oftentimes with, well, I built a business around people coming to me to learn how to gain confidence and be better riders, well, in this type of terrain. And so I'm working with people that are, they're not here yet. And oftentimes you kind of get complacent to that riding. And so when I get a day off and I get an opportunity to get pushed, come out here and get out of my comfort zone, ride with riders that are raising my level of riding every time I go. So when we get a day off, I bring my boy Austin out here with me. Austin is 25, he's from Michigan. He's a freaking shredder. He, he pushes me like no one else. So coming out here, and I've learned this from even riding with like the guys from the backcountry team ride. Anytime I get to ride with Chris Barant or Keith Curtis or Cole Wilford or Matt Entz or Jared Sessions, any of these guys that are out there just constantly pushing each other, man, do you feel the, that sense of, wow, I've still got a lot of work to do to really gain confidence to get into this, I would say, technical terrain. And so today we're gonna talk about getting out of our comfort zone, how having someone that either pushes you or is pushing or you're pushing them and how you can go back and forth feeding off of one another and that will ultimately raise your level of riding. Let's go shred. Let's do it now. It's so freaking fun. Getting out of your comfort zone, man. Day after day, we're out riding and we, we become like the best guy in your crew, right? When you're, when you're the guy that you're always leading, you're always in charge, you're taking people into your zone, you remember you get complacent. Your riding is plateaued. You're just, you're just kind of doing the same thing over and over and again. And I get it that people ride for different reasons. People come out, they, they ride with their families, they got their kids with them. And you can make those into really fantastic days. I mean, heck, that's kind of why we do it. But if the objective is to push, the objective is to get better on a snowmobile, getting out of your comfort zone, riding with people that will continually push you into that terrain that you're looking at it going, man, I would not have gone down in there if you weren't with me. I get that time and time again with my riding clinics. And I think it's so great because once you grasp snowmobiling, once you have the fundamentals, snowmobiling becomes a feeling. I'm not telling myself where I need to be on the sled. All of the backcountry basics, like where I need to be on the running board and throttle and brake and looking ahead. Once I have all of that, now it's just a matter of, you know, experimenting, going into these zones that at times, man, it gets my heart just racing. I start breathing and I'm going into this spot where I've either got somebody right in front of me or somebody right behind me just pushing me all of the time. I'm out of my comfort zone every single day I work. Every single time. Yeah, I'm like more, more like looking at me every time going, I gotta go down that? <laughs> I don't even know what a comfort zone is. Never been there. No, get, getting pushed, getting pushed outside of that and, 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 and loving it. Getting to the end of the day and knowing that you just did a bunch of stuff that, whether it was, you know, a side hill or a hop over or whatever, you know, it was a hill climb, it was something and you, 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 you didn't, you, it wasn't this idea that when in doubt, throttle out. You actually did it because it was, you were, you were intentional. You were in that terrain and you did it on purpose. You were looking ahead, you were making plans and you had all of the right ingredients to take that snowmobile and put it in the right position. 
I don't think there's anything better. I mean, I think that's the gratifying part, the challenge, right? The challenge of any mountain rider is getting in and out of these zones and doing it with the best friends you have in your whole life. I mean, that's it, right? That's a wrap. I just like to say that I've never been in my comfort zone because I have to shoot with these jokers every single day. So if you like really suck or something, like give me a call. I'd like to like maybe be the best guy for once. That would have been your plug for next level yeah. right there. I'd like to be the best guy just for once, one day. Get out of that comfort zone, you guys. I hope you really enjoyed this video. Hopefully there's a ton of GoPro footage. We got a lot of laughs out of today. It's gonna be a killer one. You guys, thanks for subscribing and we'll see you next time.